With this Museum's Victoria Triceratops specimen, we have almost the entire skeleton of one individual. One biological, real entity that we can attempt to make sense of in an evolutionary and paleobiological sense. Now that is scientifically priceless. The quality of the bone is just out of this world. The bones are just a beautiful jet black and you can see all the detail in the bone, muscle attachments, um, possible predation in some bones. It's just, it's the most perfect dinosaur bones that I've ever seen. We get to study the whole animal and you get that much closer to what it was when it was alive. We can reconstruct from skeletons things like the amount that a joint could move in life. And this helps us to constrain ideas about how an extinct animal might have walked, how it might have fed, basically put limits on our guesses as to what it did in its environment. There's a few key things that we want to learn. One is exactly how all the bones in the skeleton were put together. This seemingly fundamental aspect of the biology of Triceratops is still something we don't know. What did that potentially mean for the range of motion or locomotion of Triceratops? How did it move? It's combining things like understanding how living animals move and how bits of their skeleton correlate with certain behaviours and, and movements in life. And also, what were the horns and frill really used for? This specimen might start to give us answers to those questions. So we're not just studying the fossils anymore. We are learning about what Triceratops was in life. This Triceratops is like an accelerant for science and for research. With this being the most complete Triceratops ever found, this is now the quintessential Triceratops. So every Triceratops ever found is going to be measured against this one. It just doesn't get any cooler than this. I'm trying to contain my excitement right now because I'm trying to be super professional, but um, this is one of the most exciting projects I've ever worked on. It's every day, it's just like, can't wait.